Character of the Week. So, today's Character of the Week is Apocalypse. He's Character of the Week for no other reason is because House of X is amazing! And if you haven't read this, what are you doing with your life? His first uh, publication ap appearance was in X Factor uh, number 6. Apocalypse was born a bunch of centuries ago. God. Um, real name was in Sabanur. He uh, was left for dead by his family in a desert, uh, and he was found by this tribe, uh, like the Shadows, some sort of sand warriors or whatever. Um, but it was led by a man named Ball, who adopted this uh, mantra of survival of the fittest, um, which is a mantra that Apocalypse himself uh, decided to take upon and use the rest of his life to dedicate to the survival of the fittest for all of mankind. And quite frankly, I'm not going to get into his uh, backstory and history because it's full of time paradoxes and time travel and future people and, and past. And, and it's just so much like, woo boy. Also, depending on who wrote him, uh, his powers kind of vary, but generally it's uh, shape-shifting or mass manipulation. So he can change his density and strength and, and uh, his immortality is technically is, is a superpower too. Um, along with mass manipulation, along with it comes with his energy manipulation, strength, uh, endurance. Uh, he's not invulnerable per se, but he is um, very durable. Definitely Omega level, if beyond Omega level. He got mixed with um, celestial technology, which is kind of how he became who he is right now, which is the most common uh, costume that we see him in. You know, the big giant shoulder pads and the big ass A on his stomach. Looking like a pro wrestler. Now that's the apocalypse that we all know because of the 90s cartoon X-Men. And as much as I love Fox for making the cartoon X-Men, I also hate Fox for giving us that movie version of Apocalypse. I don't blame Oscar Isaac. The voice actor that we all have in our heads when we see or remember we read Apocalypse, um in a comic book, and we hear that voice, is a guy named uh, John Kalikos, who gave us such iconic lines as, Beast, how many peoples have dreamed of my end? You are no closer than the Babylonians with their swords and fire sticks. <laughs> and, Eat. I am as far beyond mutants as they are beyond you. Ooh, that's some Shakespearean type shit. And that's our character of the week. Alright, back to you guys.